yawn or um, try not to like hiccup or something because I get that occasionally. And so I'll still keep talking, but I sound weird. And I'm like, hopefully nobody notices. It's like, here's Shadow just calling me out on my weird tone of voice. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'll, That's I'll all that good though. Time. Oops, not that. Grab the grills and all that stuff. Oh, yeah. I might actually ferry that over to my house, the um, the extra cooking stuff. Um, yeah, no, I'm, I'll still be live for about another half an hour at this point. And whatever's left in. Just putting some stuff away post um, Blood Moon. I also have a spare gun now. Yeah, if, I, I know you said earlier that you are tired and you may not, like, play for full stream. If you're If you're too tired, that's all good. I'll just do building shit. Um, no, I'm fine. Put some food away. Mm. I have these nasty ass sandwiches. I don't know. Oh, we used up all the food. God yep. fucking damn it. I hate the fact that we can't um, make any good food. Ah, oh, it pisses me off. What do we got? We got dog food? I'll eat some dog food. That'll do her. And maybe uh, some cat food just to balance it out because it can't be favoring one more than the other. I, I shoot photographs equally. I eat the, the food equally where possible. I just hope nobody's been snacking on the peas. So it's a hard to find late game. Let's see, I have spare water, so somebody could take that. And I'll guzzle down some and I'll put back the corn. It's been cooked. Yeah, that'll do it. Um uh, 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 uh. I don't know, Blood Moon went alright, honestly. Um all things considered, headache and stuff. Oh, I actually have read the super corn recipe. I thought I hadn't. I must have found it somewhere. This is my uh, one. Keep that I'll on read me. It then. Um, do you want a spare little armor pocket mod? Mm, nah. Alright. I think we're just storing shit like that. Whatever can go in here. Let's see. Armor. I've got that spare now for somebody. Uh, that should really be gone. But then again, somebody could be really low level and need it. Yeah, so this time I didn't actually die. Um, Grim didn't die either. We sat on top of, you know, the checkpoint that I chose the first time that was such a fail? Yeah, well, that worked this time. We cleaned out, like, a whole heap of the area. Um, then kind of... Oh, I should get the stuff out of my bike too. Yeah, we, we, we like, scrapped down a whole heap of the place. And then... Um, kind of just pulled apart that's not my bike that's my bike yeah pulled apart a whole heap of stuff and we only had the um a little rope ladder and if they could dog pile onto it there was also a proper metal ladder but nobody dog piled on that thank god so we only had the one to deal with and that basically just meant that okay we just had this one thing to shoot and the zombies finished about 2 30 which was good because it meant that we could get down and actually start heading back before dawn. So again, also nice. Okay, let me put away that. I will need more water. But yeah, no, I'll take a half of that with me. Because I'm going to head over to my base and maybe do some construction stuff. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's it's good. This is the third blood moon. I, I'll check what I drop in here. It's the third blood moon. And I think we did really well. All things considered. Um, I could have gone a lot, lot worse. I thought I had cash. Uh, I do have cash. Yeah, it could have gone a lot worse, honestly. Um, that's what I want to get rid of is a spare pistol. That can go back in here for somebody. Um, but yeah, we survived and we we're just discussing how we think it could get worse from here on out. But the whole thing was the, the only reason why we were so close to the ground in the first part was because I really wanted to stress out my computer and see how well it did. And I, it still sounds like it's off and the room is still fucking cold. So I assume that it's fine. Um, I'll check out all my stats and stuff after stream anyway and see how it went. But I am assuming it's going to be just fine. Because um, what was happening beforehand was that Blood Moon would happen and I literally, uh, I could not look around without lagging out for a second and even just general game, I couldn't look around without lagging out. And then when Blood Moon happened, like having my avatar up and stuff was making it difficult and I was starting to get warnings of like 
uh, it was overheating to the point where it was going to shut down and stuff. So, whereas I didn't get any of that this time. So that's good. I think what happened is my CPU cooler died in the last time I played Blood Moon because it was getting close and then I think it just went, um, which I'm really grateful that um, Triantha TV helped get that one fully funded so that I didn't have to worry this week at all and that I wasn't going to like crash in the middle of a stream or something, you know? Um, was it a bit of low hanging fruit, but blood moon sounds like euthanism for a bad period. Eh. Yeah, no, I don't discuss stuff like that. So don't ever worry about it being something like that. Cause that is not a topic that I discuss publicly. Um, so if you ever hear something like that, it's literally just the game has, um, like, Every seven days, it has Blood Moon, which is basically like a phenomenal event, or whatever, that uh, all these waves of zombies just keep happening from 10 p.m. until 4 p.m., just nonstop. Um, in this case, it stopped at like 2.30. So usually it slows down and you're still kind of dealing with the excess of zombies between 2.30 and 4. But it wasn't as bad today. We are able to kind of manage it. Um, I think I want to put... There's mods somewhere for here. I was going to take a couple of chairs, fuck around with that, because I'm going to make, I'll take four just in case, and I'll take the rest of these pot plants, because I'm mostly taking those to my base. Take a couple of camping chairs. Yeah, I'll put those outside. I think I've got enough wooden chairs. We'll take them. I, I love fucking de <laughs> decorating a shit. <laughs> um, I waste so much time with stuff like that. All right. Now, I thought farming would have it, but somewhere in here, is it? it is a mod. I keep looking at this and going, this isn't the box that I need, but it is. Like, yeah, that goes in there. Somebody else can have a little pocket. Um, yeah. No, I, um, I always figure it's worth just giving it, like, a couple of extra seconds of, like, information because, um... If one person's asked a question, somebody else might be thinking it and maybe not comfortable asking. So I don't really mind. Like if somebody's brought up a topic, I don't mind like going into a little bit of depth and being like, yeah, this is this is a why. Um, just in case somebody else is thinking it. Because more often than not, you don't you don't know. Somebody else could be and just like uncomfortable. Um, I don't think I need building blocks. I actually think I've got building blocks at my base. I'm going to head over to my base, Grim, and just, like, do some construction uh, stuff. Hold up. Where you go? Where are you? I'm in the box room. Mm, yep. I was going to say, it better not be a sandwich. Nice. Thank you. Me able to ask a question without issue? Yeah, no, that's, that's a pretty good one to have. All right, well, I'll, I'll do some questing then. All right. Yeah, I figure I'm just going to go around and fuck with my base for a little bit since I've got a bit of time. Yep, yep. Um, I want to make some money. Yeah. But you guys are, like, way above me. I pretty much figure, what, Thursday? I'm going to spend a lot of that time probably um, actually doing quests and shit if I can. Where the fuck is my base? It's that way. Man, I'm so bad with directions. Yeah, no, I, I actually find, like, um, you know how you get, like, uh, what is it, FAQ pages or stuff like that where it's, like, frequently asked questions? I always look at it this way, that if one person ends up with a question, then that question is going to get asked probably more than once. Um, and answering with my voice, like, actually just, taking a couple of seconds to give an answer is a lot faster than um, oh, wow. answering a bunch of individual questions. Hoard. What's going on? Oh, you got a hoard up there. I just yep. rode off. Damn it. Typical. I'm probably too far away Run to away. even get XP. <laughs> Look, I had a feeling that I needed to get the fuck out of there, and it wasn't just you. Like, obviously, that was it was more than just you this time, Grim. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, <good bag. laughs> Oh yeah, I'm surprised oh, two that they. Bags. I'm surprised that they did a hoard so soon after fucking Blood Moon. That's a little bit illegal. A little bit. Hmm. Yeah, I bet there's a road that I could be riding on. There is a road. 
that I could be oh, riding on. Loot bags. Oh my gosh, it's payday. Jesus. Well, it, it turns out it was worth you doing the killing. That water's not going to do much if she's that thirsty. I should have brought yeah, a little bit more. Of notes, couple of steroids, yep. Nice. Good money makers. I should have taken some cobblestone oh, with me. Oh, and silver nuggets. Nice. I can drive up here. Challenge right after challenge. It is illegal. Uh, I know the reference. That, uh, it, it reminds me of, like, The Simpsons. Um, where it's like, would you like a, a frozen yogurt? I call it a froget. And he's like, ooh. And he's like, um, you get your choice of toppings, but they're cursed. And, like, every other thing is fucking cursed. I'm trying to think it's the exact it same thing. The, uh, weapon trader. That was interesting. When I was far enough back, you could just barely see in through that door. I'm not sure. Who used to be the weapons trader? See? Uh, How cool is that? Um, hey, Grim, if you got a chance, have a look at my stream for a second, because I'm looking at the electrical building, and at a certain distance, the door doesn't render, so you can see inside. Yeah. And as I move towards it, the door appears. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, that's pretty interesting. Same thing's happening with the motel. It's kind of like a sneak peek into these buildings. You can actually see if there's like a loot area or something that you want to actually take the time to get into. Speaking of, this car should be lootable by now. I haven't driven out here for a while. Have a look. Yep. Oh, got an infection. God oh. damn it. See, I like leaving the cars yeah. out and about because sure. I can sometimes get some extra loot and sometimes they have some good stuff like a lock pick or something. Maybe I should take this path out. It should theoretically drive me all the way out to my base. Let's check. Sometimes it's a little bit faster just to stay on the road. Plus, if this actually does go out there, how fancy. You know, I get a fucking pathway out to my house. Who else gets that in the apocalypse? I, obviously, people that choose bases that have pathways. But, I mean, I didn't choose mine with that in mind. Oh, man, Jesus Christ, I went over a blade of grass and it completely brought me to a halt. What would happen if I go over that chicken? Somebody started here. I'm going to guess, hold up, where am I on the map? I'm going to guess Nick because from what I remember, I'm pretty sure Flanky started up here. This has to be Nick's. He would be the weapon wow. Guy. Okay, well, I'll have to get rid of that eventually and fix up the driveway, but that's interesting. It's it's a hallmark of wherever we start on the server is you've got to make like the standard stuff like build a queue, build a quick top, all this blah blah blah, and then you've got to put it down and upgrade it. And so we put it wherever we start, as this is where I started. So yeah, that's interesting. That's going to be a problem when I end up getting a car, but for right now I've only got a I've only got a bicycle. And not much of a problem. The only problem here is if I die, I end up back where Grim is. Give me this, that one was outside. So the other thing I've got to do too is it's hard to see, but here. I've got to put a little line in this corner. There's not much to it though. I should be able to do that. I just need to get some of the blocks are inside and finish upgrading this as well. So it's at least one to two with like the decent blocks. And then I'll go with like cobblestone and all sorts of shit. This place doesn't need to be fancy, but I'm pretty sure I've got doors around the back here. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't need to be fancy, this place. It just needs to be secure enough for me to feel like I'd like to stand inside the walls. The only thing is that the parts that I've upgraded don't look like they're upgraded where they're supposed to be from the inside. But anyway. All right. I should start repairing some shit like these, like, doors and windows and stuff, you know? So what I was looking at is they've got like desks and shit now, right? So I was going to make like a little computer space, maybe like upstairs. Like down here looks like it's good too, but I wanted to see what have I got in here? A lot. Okay, so I've got plenty of boxes I could definitely work with outside. That away. Um, I'm going to need those for those corner bits. I'm not going to need that many. I do have extra wood. Thank God. I thought I didn't. Now chairs and shit and this thing. And this thing, they're all things I want to put down. Give me the plants. I've got plants to put fucking everywhere and probably seeds and shit. But the eggs, I'm slowly stockpiling eggs over here. I do have cooked stuff. I do need to go downstairs. Oh, I did have a pot. Or maybe I put that away just then. I don't know. 
All right, well, either way, I can go and run these around and whatever I've got can stack up. Cool. Nice. I will deal with the extra plants soon, but let's first things first, get into this kitchen. Let's see, probably about here might be nice. I can't. I don't know how this is going to paint so far because you can only paint a side at a time, but I am going to make a campfire. A bicycle can sit inside my inventory for a few minutes, honestly. <laughs> can I not put that there? Why can't I put that there? Because things are above it. Let's see. Whoa. Fucking hell. Can I, can I has ground? Thank you. Jesus. What is wrong with this spot? Is it because of that? Let's find out. It's like tonight. Tonight on acrylic stream. It's like, let's see if I can has space by removing boards off windows. Also, what do I require? Apparently just wood to fix glass. That's the important thing. Yes. Okay, so that's all it was, is the boards behind it. Now it seems a little bit exposed, but whatever. Okay, give me this. Let's see. I need that, that, that. And in my fireplace, we actually have wood. And I'm okay with that. Um, <laughs> it's the fastest way to trigger anybody else on this server, honestly, is putting not this in there. Um, although it was very interesting at one point we had a, um, server member that had played back in the really, really early games where you required to actually have fuel to fuel this. So they actually put like cartons of fuel in there and we're like, apart from the fact that that does not look safe, like a, a drum of fuel, like if I type in here for fuel, uh, not that one. Oh, well, that'd be the only thing I could make. I couldn't actually make the proper thing, but yeah. Um, all sorts of fucking things. Maybe I can make it on here. Maybe it shows it. Fuel? No. Okay. Well, there's basically like drums of fuel and stuff like that that you can get. And it was just one of those weird times where it just didn't show it that way. A fireplace on a wooden chest. I know, right? I put it on a cardboard box last time. It was fantastic. You know what I should have done? Hold up. I know that's in the kitchen. And I know I won't be able to like pick the whole thing up, but I'm going to put a second one in here. This is where I should have put one. Yeah, come on, let me put it down. Right there. That'll look good once it's up and running. The only reason why I was keeping that was the little embers allow for light. But yeah, a second one here would be good. Um, considering I spend a lot of time cooking shit, this will be very, very useful for me. So we'll have one in the actual kitchen and we'll have one in the fireplace because if Gordon Ramsay can cook a fucking toasted sandwich in a fireplace, I'm sure it's highly acceptable to boil water and all sorts of shit in that place. You know, that's the way I see it. Um, what's that? Eight Cassie Manor. It's like a porridge, but it's smolly and not oats. Interesting. So you had it with Nutella and banana shake to cool down feel like you ate a kilogram of sugar. That does sound like a kilogram of sugar, but my God, does that sound nice? That sounds really nice. Like, I'm in the thick of winter, but that that sounds refreshing and enjoyable. Um, good choice of chair or old chair. I can't craft this chair into anything more fancy, but I can at least put this around the fucking table in a direction that's like semi-fucking pleasing. That is very close to there. Do you pick a direction? Because I keep moving these and they keep changing. There we go. These are all kinds of like scattered around the place. If I could tuck them underneath, I would. But I can't. So at least they're like facing places. I've got a couple of these. I'm going to make more of them at some point. I don't know. I think I've got one of these. I don't know about this being like a lounge room. There's like a little seating area up there. I can make this space like a semi-lounge room. But yeah, I essentially want to make like a little computer and put it on this so that like you can have like a couple of desks. I think I could move that over if I got rid of that bookcase. And I could have two desks here and that would be a good computer spot, I think. Or like over here. Either or is fine. Um, interesting. Well, funny thing enough, like the Capri Sun scenes, like we used to have them here as well when I was a kid. But... Um, to find one now as an adult, 
I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to be looking for or if it's just not available. Mind you, like, the... I have a Woolies that I regular, right? And it removes things every so often. Like, if it's not popular enough, they don't stock it, which is really frustrating because I could bet you almost fucking anything that the few things that I use are not available in that store. Okay, that needs cobblestone somehow. Um, yeah, I've had it a couple of times. It's been really frustrating where, like, I go up and I need to buy something. It doesn't matter if it's fresh produce or, like, an ingredient or, like, a necessity in my house, and it's no longer available. And the next nearest one it is is, like, going to be Coles or maybe half an hour away at another Woolies, which is really fucking frustrating. Like, I should be able to... I know this is really first world problem, but I should really be able to get all the items that I'm there to buy from one store. Um, it should be like just a matter of preference. Like if I want to go to one or the other, but mind you, like Coles has a lot of like, like the sushi rice and stuff like that, that are just better ingredients that they have versus like our Woolies. Our Woolies is shit for a lot of things. All right. Now I forgot that there was a basement in this place. That's fine though. I'm not getting anything in there. I just wanted to make sure that nothing was spawning down here. And I also need to find this. I'm going to need cobblestone to repair that, which I should actually be able to make, maybe. Clay. All right. That's fine. I did dig up a fuck ton of clay somewhere else. Most of this place is fine. But probably that's a double door. I might put a roller or something on that. Um... This is a horrible design, but that's fine. I, I feel like that crammed in there is just, like, bad. But anyway, uh, still end up going to three supermarkets because only one has decent cheese, the other has decent meat, and the last one, you just need that special treat you like. It is like that. I have to agree with that logic. I need to put some chairs outside. I was going to put a, a proper computer chair here. Get a real seat in front of this thing. We do that sometimes. Um, like, for instance, um, our Woolies doesn't always have... Um, doesn't always have, like, a good selection of meat that I can eat. I'm going to just put two there for now because I know what I'm doing with that later. Um, the rest of these chairs I think I'm mostly done with. I'll put two seats outside somewhere. Have I got seats out here? Yeah, I've got little decky chairs out here. That's fine. I'll do it. Um, yeah, so we often go to Coles just to get, you know, a meat that I can eat because I can't eat like all your standard, um, you know, chicken, beef, pork, or lamb. Right. Um, so, yeah. I'm going to go back to base and then I'm going to log off. All right. I'm still just up, uh, doing up a couple of things around my base and then I'll hop off. Yep. I put that away. Um, I don't have much longer actually. Might just see what I can do here. Get down. That took me down here pretty fast. Yeah, I'm gonna have to clean up this area and stuff, but I'm thinking over here might be an okay side because I kind of come out here and I kind of come in here. I meant to put this chair up somewhere else. Yeah, anyway. Um, could you press uh, have a nice day for Grim? Um, Shadow is saying, have a nice day, Grim. So, hope you have a nice oh, yeah. rest and whatnot. Oh, uh, I'll be, um, in chat soon. Oh, yeah. Well, oh, there you I go. Still, yeah, I'll still hang around. Yeah, I'll, I'll only be, um, streaming for a few more minutes anyway. Um, I, I'm not going to push it tonight with the, with the fucking migraine. So, I want to be able to think when I play Room World tomorrow, maybe. Yep. I don't know if I can get all my seeds down, but I'll just do a line of places, I maybe. Could, um, I could do some more quests, but I'm just like, yeah, no. Nah. Yeah, no, it is sort of pushing the time anyway. There we go. I think that's in line with the house. Oh, and I also am in line with a clock in my base. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. Your base is in town, isn't it? Oh, yeah, you're at it now. Yeah. Another drop over um, 
Right. I'm trying to make the upstairs more like yeah. a uh, gentleman's bar. <laughs> nice. Um, yeah. Uh, let's see. And then I'm, I'm going to work this to be from my thick. way from the top to the bottom and uh, right just now. do improvements over the time. Oh, yeah. Um, on top of the roof. I could probably put this on the balcony. I have a ramp. So oh, okay. um, when I have my bike out, I can just um, jump off the ramp. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, it makes sense. I put this like here somewhere. All right. Oh, that's too. Oh, it's probably because it's up on here. I'll Hold see up. you another day. Yeah. All right. I'll catch you later, Grim. Let's see. Okay, Wait. I can't. Can't fit that up here. And it could be that thing where I've got to put it on the ground. So if that's the case, it might actually be worth trying to stick it in between here. Hold up, let me see how far is that going to be from the wall. That would allow me one more row. Like, I'm going to do a fuck ton of like farm plots because I always do a fuck ton of farm plots. But I mean, I could also just stick this out in like a corner situation, like here or something. That would probably also work. Let's do that. Yeah, I don't mind that. I could have potentially up to four in the four corners plus like farm plots skirting around this place. That would work. So that's making stuff. I'm not going to be here frequently enough to have more than one, but one will get me at least some water if I need it here. And the other thing I was going to do that I wanted to do, I wanted to put, can I choose colors? Ooh, I can. Fancy. Is that brown or is that? Gray is close enough to black. That is not gray. The lies. Let me see a different color. Mmm, okay, that's slightly purpley. That's yellow. Come on. If you can make yellow, you can make a color. Uh, brown just looks like mold. What about red? Red red looks pink, it's fine. Look, red looks like it will match these fucking little trees, and I can't even sit this where I want it because of the um windows. So let me take that. They'll do it. I'm gonna have one over here and take that. Stick one there. That'll do it. Look, it looks so fucking post-apocalyptic welcoming, this place. Honestly. Oh, for fuck's sake, you're thirsty now. I know, Grim. I know. I was going to put some spikes out and around the place, but I don't think I'm honestly going to have that much time. So, uh, what is on this side of the balcony? Actually, quite a lot of space. Wow. Give me that. No, I don't want to just put it there, yeah? Okay, so I didn't realize that there was like a little back fence to this. This is kind of cool. You know what's going there, right? <laughs> it's 100%. If I can fit them, I can fit them somewhere. I'll choose different ones like this or something. Uh, they're pretty teeny tiny, but they'll do. I can fit them. Come on. God damn it. I can't put it in the corner where I want it. Damn. Because I was going to do like really tall ones like this. Because, like, wherever I can put these fuckers, I'm going to put them. Yeah, like that. Uh, that's concerning, Grim. You, you're lurking like a shark. Uh, God, I don't know about you guys, but my OCD fucking hates this shit. Like, come on. Why? I understand that there's a few spots here. I imagine it's stuck with that hole. But, oh, my God, does this shit... This couple of squares the wrong way. Really, like, screw off my head. All right. This place isn't looking too bad. It's definitely got some fucking work, like, fixing up that door so it doesn't look, like, horrible. I would like to make one that just looks like that instead of, like, the weird-ass doors that we make, like these. I would think by now maybe that they would have, maybe in building. I know, I am in building. Maybe they have nicer... Stuff like wooden furniture and stuff, I can do wonders with that shit. If I can make it, I'll make some bedside tables that actually, like, hold stuff. Give me that. Um, where was that furniture? Can I make it? I can't. I need nails. That's fine, though. That pot plant can go back up. Yeah, a nicer one, thanks. All right, maybe the red one. That'll do it. That looks right. All right, let's see. I've got extra farm plot, extra seed thing. I've got all my seeds Probably got time to throw that down. I don't have time for that. Um, 
I guess my money and shit can sit in here. Um, yeah, bicycle can stay there. I have got a lot of blocks and I don't need that many for here. And I think the guys would probably prefer them for burning than the fact that I've mostly done building. The only thing I haven't done is I could use this to say shape into, or is it like that? That might end up sitting in the corner outside. That's the only thing I could think of. Have I got everything else here I want? So I've got like spikes and shit. Like I'd do some spikes and whatever, maybe next time. Um, but all this crap needs to go back to base. This this stays with me and this stuff needs to go back over. Water can stay with me. Yeah, all that shit's got to go. But yeah, I might see if I can do some of those two next week. And realistically, I know I just put it away, but realistically I should keep this shit on me because once I go back over the other way, I'll need it for buying shit. But yeah, I should plant seeds and stuff. I'll see what I can do about that before I forget. I could put mushrooms everywhere. I will be putting mushrooms everywhere. But I think for now, I'll just jump on the bed, smash my head into the fan because, you know, that's what